I think it must be such a brain melting experience to come across uh, an idea of the Adjustment Bureau, let alone to be confronted in a physical sense by this, this bigger force than you ever imagined. So it's remarkable that he chooses to fight that. And I think it, it shows great, uh, great spirit of character in him that he chooses to fight against that and uh, not be led by that and or frightened by that or put off by it. Um, I think it speaks volumes about the attraction that these two people really have for each other, that he is willing to risk a lot for her. And there's something ominous about them in how human they are. You know, I think that that's hopefully what will really work with this, this bigger force that we're not trying to do a very sci-fi you know, people dressed in all in one black leather suits, you know, it's like, they're very real. They're, they're, there's something frightening in how real they are and the power that they have in how human normal they look. I think with ballet or certain kinds of dance, you work hard your whole life to achieve some kind of ethereal perfection, which you never can get. And I remember one of the dancers I spoke to, she was actually my double in this, and she said, you know, I really believe that everything you go through in life can come out in the way that you dance. And that's, and this kind of dance allows for that, and it's incredibly expressive and human, and so it was a wonderful experience. It, it allowed for mistakes, I think, but it was incredibly hard. The training was um, unreal. I hurt every day, every day. <laughs> I just thought, oh, thank God, this man has written a feisty, strong, layered, complicated girl who can kind of hold her own, and she's tough, but she's vulnerable, and there was, lot to, there was a lot to play with. The dialogue was great, it was witty, it was bantery between them, and I recognized it. You know, I recognized it as how, like, people really talk, you know? And uh, so that jumped out at me, the relationship and the, the connection and how... Um, it didn't seem contrived how they fell in love. They almost fell in love through laughing at each other, and it was, it was a very, sh it was that secret language. I thought he managed to capture the secret language between two people when they're in love. He's an instantly likable guy. He's sort of an impossibly awesome guy, you know? And uh, we hit it off instantly, and um, you're kind of only as good as your co-star. So if you've got someone who's willing to play and dance with you in the scene, and um, it's just heaven, like you just want to run to work.